Okay, here we are in the Twelfth Night Theatre with the amazing Melinda Schneider, who just gave us four of the most amazing numbers, two of the same song, but uh, that was so <laughs> unbelievable, Melinda. Thanks for your time. Thank you. Um, can you tell me a bit about your journey with Doris Day and where it began, I believe, just in, I guess, in your own bedroom at some stage, and what was it like when you first heard this amazing voice for the first time? Oh, my first memory of Doris is seeing her on Calamity Jane, the film, uh, when I was a little kid, just on the Saturday afternoon movies. So I loved that character, you know, she was just rooting, tooting, whip, cracking, sharp shooting, tomboy kind of <laughs> character. And um, I don't know, I guess I could relate to it because my mum was a country singer and that just felt very natural for me. Um, I also loved the, the, the makeover factor, the fact that she was, you know, this real tomboy and rough around the edges and then they polished her up at the end and she ended up as a blushing bride. So <laughs> it was just a beautiful film with a happy ending and, and lots of fun and lots of joy. Tell me how your own personal connection to Doris filters through Doris, the show that we're going to see. Well, we've got a few things in common. We're both born to German Catholic families, though I don't think her mother yodeled like mine did. <laughs> Uh, we both love our dogs, and we've both made similar mistakes with men. So there's a few parallels there with our lives, um, and that does filter throughout the show because Doris had four terrible marriages. I only had one marriage that didn't work. <laughs> Thank goodness I won't be repeating that to, to Doris's extent. But um, you know, I can really relate to, to some of the things that that she did with men. Uh, Some speaking, of the mistakes she made. Yeah. <laughs> speaking of dogs, you brought your own here today. And, yeah. um, you know, uh, one thing I didn't know, uh, Doris is an animal activist. Um, you're a lover of dogs, lover I of animals am. yourself. Who do we bring here today? Girls? This is Daisy. Hello, Rosie. Daisy. Hello, Rosie. <laughs> they're so good. <laughs> they're, they're in the show. Yeah, um, how do they come in the show? So they come towards the end of the show. We wake them up. Interestingly, when they come on stage. I sing them a song that I wrote called Your Eyes Could Never Lie, which is a song I wrote for them because they're just, they've been so loyal, they've been with me through all of my personal yeah, losses so in my life, yeah. you know, they're 13, they've been with me for, you know, all those years and they really are beautiful dogs, they're my best mates, they're my babies, I haven't had kids yet so these are my babies. <laughs> Melinda Schneider, thank you so much for some insight and for those songs and best of luck for the next three weeks in Brisbane. Thank you. Thanks thank for you. coming. Cheers. Thanks, Thanks a lot. <laughs>